case. Now, this also leads into another larger conversation. I don't know if we can continue to this dialogue is the differences between soul food and Southern food. Yeah, I mean, that's a much larger conversation that I think both Brian and I, we have tried to sink our teeth into on so many different ways. And we're still at a stalemate in terms of what can we really sort of unpack and uncover Mm -hmm. besides just Southern food is oftentimes the absence of black people and the absence of, you know, soul food in terms of just a replication of that or a sad caricature of that minus black people and also minus chitlins as well. Right. No, you're right. I'm real serious about this in terms of name a white person that has ever made chitlins and made a name for his or herself. I can't even think of Paul. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you're right. I, I didn't even think about it like that. Like, right. Because even because even Sean Brock one. doesn't he doesn't that's even go into that yeah. no come on somebody and that's see, like this is the one thing huh. this is the one thing that is identifiably different mm-hmm. between those two cuisines that is something that is not hey i'm not going to touch that okay? mm-hmm. 